<laughs> I forgot that was a door that, that frightened. That scared the shit out of me. That should not have scared the shit out of me. But it did. What a cute boy! So cute. Got two hidden ones left now. Ooh. Now the music seems really quiet, but I think that is just because I'm pretty sure pronunciation was correct. Uh, let's just say that I didn't spend much time outdoors when I was a kid. Ah, so you're just doing like a lot of reading and learning about random subjects. I'd like to say that I did the same, but I'm not actually sure how much of the information stayed in my head. Sometimes it does just go in one ear and out the other. Feather palps. Interesting that I've never actually heard that before. I wonder if my dad even knows that, because he, he likes spiders. I'm not sure he's done any like actual research on them but he's one of those guys that tends to be like chocked full of seemingly pointless knowledge and this is probably the first time in 20 years i <laughs> had a use for that fact nice it's got three open one hidden left not even sure. This is still horrifying. And by that, I mean last time I definitely said it kind of looked like a cat. Which up close it does not. There should absolutely be a cat in one of these boots. I've already searched a fair bit down here. I feel like I'm just clicking on random stuff now. I should turn off the cat cam again. I wish I had a remote control for it so I don't have to stand up every time. It's annoying. That was so obvious, I literally missed that. Oh, so cute. Hey look, that's the dude from the game. Oop. Okay, just one hidden one left then. Tentacle. I thought this was like a sort of context clue. I feel like I've clicked on most of the stuff already. That could be wrong. This is adorable. I don't know why cats playing cards is really cute. And this is a sword. I only just got that. So it's like some kind of hanging decoration. Which I suppose a sword can be. It does feel like there should be more in this corner. Presumably it would be something openable. Hey, 
dark. How you doing? Yeah, we're playing a castle full of cats. It's pretty neat. It is Toby Toby's birthday yesterday, technically. And uh, he's been playing with toys and he's been having his dreamies and now he's falling asleep on my bed. And I really should turn off his webcam, but I just can't be asked getting up again. But yeah, it's good to see you. I hope you're doing well. I love the color change, by the way. Purple is a very nice color. Um, we've got one hidden cat left. I'm gonna do a big zoom out. And this is it. Can't get any... Oh, we can get a little bit lower. But not like a huge amount. Got one hidden cat left. Is it like cat hidden in the drawing we have to spot? Yes, yes. Right now we're going after the blue ones, which have been like hidden behind other objects and we sort of have to guess what kind of objects they are. But I feel like I've clicked on basically everything. Oh wait, there he is. Nice. It's a really just nice chill game and it's just got cats in it. So it's just nice. Building full of cats, I think was the first one. Then they got Castle Full of Cats. There's also the Hidden Cats in Paris, London. There's like a whole bunch of them that I plan on playing at some point because they're just really nice and chill. Okay. Ooh, the kitchen. Oh, they're all so cute. Cute little kitties. Yeah, building full of cats was really fun. It had like a hidden level and it was basically a fallout shelter. It was so, it was just so good. Roof, the roof level I think was a hidden one, a hidden level as well and that was really good. How many of these cats are in pots? Go on, this one is just begging. Seriously? Yeah, there we go. Don't you show me your butt. Rude. This just resembles my house. Ooh, arcade full of cats is out soon. Nice. I've stuck a bunch of them on my wish list. I actually love games like this where it's literally just me finding pictures of things in a big picture of other things. I don't know what it is about it that speaks to me, but it's just really, really nice. Not in the barrel. Not in any of these pots, I find that hard to believe. Oh, oh that he's got a little cupcake! At least I think that's a cupcake. I can't tell. I know what it is, it's me serious cats. I mean, yeah, that would be it. But I did play one where we were finding bees. That one was good. I initially played it because I was hoping it would um, help cure me of my affliction towards buzzing because every time you clicked on the bees it would make a buzzing sound and I have a really bad problem with buzzing it makes me <laughs> and um, I had the, I drew the conclusion that it would either help cure it or it would make it worse I do actually think it just made it worse <laughs> but it was a really fun game and I had a good time playing that one see I love little games I just love this kind of games where you just get to like pick hidden objects out of things it's, it's nice yeah, gotcha. There's so many places that cat could be. Window? Window. Nah. Alright. Behind the tapestry? Why is there a triangle hanging here? Excuse me. Just grapes. Alright. Who hangs grapes from the ceiling? Who does that? Okay, I've initially only got two hidden cats left, so that's nice. Okay, this is a different area, so I'm gonna go back. I'll do that one in a bit. Um, geez. Lots of cheese. Where are these cats hiding? So many pots. So much pot. I think I've clicked all these already. But then I forget which ones I've clicked. Oh fuck. 
My legs are just really hurt. They just re really hurt. What is this meant to be? I actually love the cluttered rooms, but it does make it a lot harder to figure out what's cookable and what's not. Barrel, maybe? <gasps> That's a yes. Um, one more. <laughs> that should not have startled me. But yeah, these are like prime chill out games. If you ever just want to have a chill time and click on cats. These games are definitely, like, really good for that. <laughs> Got it. <This> scared me. <laughs> oh. Look at this guy. I stay here at the pantry making sure... Him is Seth. <laughs> Someone steals our supplies, especially for Fino, who would definitely build a s hidden passage from his bedroom just to get here and steal salami. I mean, it sounds like he's got his, he's like his goals straight. He's goal oriented, and that seems important. I love this guy. Why is he giving me the side eye? I'm literally here just to find cats. Not even take cats, just find them. The sun looks real angry. Oh. Cool. Can I pop any of these corks? That seems moderately disappointing. Okay, well that seems to be locked. The, the locked thing is like really jarring. <laughs> like it doesn't need to be quite that intense. Look at this guy. He's just having a good time. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Cheeky. Is there any of these fishes? Not a very big room. Oh, all the way up into the rafters, eh? Well, I've got one of these guys up here already. They still look like they could be tails, but I think they're just stalks. Gonna say the same thing? No, he doesn't say anything else. Ooh. A little dude. Nothing under there. The Nimbus 2000s, really? <laughs> All right. 